Welcome to the Eat Audio. Release your wolf. You were curious too, huh? Oh yeah, I know you're there. Oh, don't get scared now. I'm not going to eat you or anything like that. I'm just a fellow urban explorer who's fond of this old mall. I ain't been watching you through the walls or some crazy thing like that. I still haven't had the faintest idea what you look like. I can smell you, though. Nice cologne or perfume, by the way. No need to run. You'll just get lost faster. I've checked this place out a few times now. It's becoming a favorite haunt of mine. It's bigger than you'd expect on the inside, though. More twisty. Oh, yeah, a brave soul like you. I'm sure you can handle it by yourself. But you and I aren't the only visitors around here. Hey, now, I said don't get scared. They won't get nasty unless they think they got a reason to. And if you go stumbling around blind in the dark, well, then you might just give them one. Hold on, hold on. I'll come down there to you. Hey, there you are. Ooh, you look as pretty as you smell. Well, it's true, so why deny it? My name's Dade. How about you? Come on, you've seen a werewolf before. We're not even rare in these parts. Maybe not all of us like to let our ears and tails hang out like this, but you've seen us. Oh, I don't like to inhibit myself, at least not any more than needed to to keep the peace. We can get pretty rowdy sometimes, no use in denying that either. Well, a little rowdiness never hurt nobody. For example, I wouldn't mind getting a touch rowdy with you, bright eyes. <laughs> all right, all right. Anyhow... That's why I like sneaking into this mall sometimes. It's been closed down for years, so it's a nice, big, empty space to wolf around in, so to, so to speak. Blow off some steam without bothering anybody. Well, except for those other guests I mentioned, but they ain't so bad once you figure out their boundaries. How about you, bright eyes? What brings a pretty little thing like you to a dingy place like this? Well, you've got an odd idea of fun. I like that. <laughs> Sorry, pal. You've just got this cute blush. But I'm losing track of myself now. This ain't the best place for exploring, at least if you're not prepared. Empty spaces like this where there used to be a lot of hustle and bustle, but uh, isn't anymore. Well, they tend to track some things. There's still memories here, see? Still something left behind. And that brings all sorts out to root through it. I'm talking about ghosts, friend. Spirits whose business isn't done in this world. Who should have moved on but can't or just won't. Oh, I can smell them, too. It's a weird scent, like eggs that aren't quite right yet. But, uh, you know they're getting right close. Now, I can't see them, same as I couldn't see you. Difference is, you won't see them until they let you. And if they let you, it ain't often to be very friendly. They feel a pull to this place. There's something here they still want to find or experience or whatever. Well, shadows attract shadows and memories call them memories. But as long as we don't bother them, they shouldn't bother us. Huh. Well, that's tough to say. You could just follow my lead. I've come to know them fairly well. And after all, you wanted to explore, right? Well, there's still plenty to see around here. Oh, come on. You ain't shy, are you? Hey, I knew you looked like a brave one. 
Were you ever in this place while it was open? No, oh, hell, neither was I. Only moved here with the pack a few years back. But while rooting around, I came across... Hey, have you ever heard of an aquarium in a mall? Yeah, that makes two of us again, but this place had one. Nothing too fancy, still smells a bit like fish. The tanks are all empty now, but the lights still work. Hey, care to see? Hell yeah! Oh, uh, might want to keep your voice down a bit. Uh, cute as it is, the spirits can get antsy if you make too much of a racket. Follow me. Um, curiosity mostly. He used to scare me real bad thinking about what happened to us after we die. Lost my dad when I was a pup, see? So I started investigating a bit, just to, you know, comfort myself. Trying to figure out if Dad was all right on the other side, I suppose. Well, we don't know too much about the other side, but we know a bit about ghosts. And other things which should be there, but aren't. And for what it's worth, I've never run into my own father's ghost. Hmm. It ain't too scary once you start to get your head, well, around what uh, there is to get around right now. These spirits here don't seem bad, just... A little lost, I suppose. Here we are, down this hall. Oh, now you're worried. Friend, if you were worried about me gobbling you up, why'd you follow me this far? You know, none of the surveillance system in this place work anymore, right? Well, now that's a very hurtful stereotype. <laughs> nah, you're good. Most of us have adapted just fine to modern life. If you saw me in wolf shape, you might just think I was someone's pet husky. I take the utmost care of my fur, thank you very much. Ha, <laughs> none taken. I'd let you scratch behind my ears any time. So, uh, you still want to see them lights? All right, let's go. Now, try not to judge it too much, because I know it looks something like out of a horror movie now. I'll show you up in the control room, though. Ah, here it is. Now, just give me a second. Ah, let there be light. Now, let's go take a look. See? Not so bad once the lights are on. Like those soothing blue tinted ones inside the tanks, and these nice soft ones in the ceilings. Looks a bit more like some kind of fancy dance club now than an aquarium, but nothing we can do for that now. You like? Oh, it's my pleasure, bright eyes. Always happy to show a pretty stranger like yourself a good time. The lighting seems to agree with you, if you don't mind me saying. So, um, uh, once we're done here, uh, you got any plans? Uh, other than leaving the mall, which, uh, I'm happy to help with. Oh, yeah. Well, it just so happens I know a nice breakfast place that ought to be open just a few hours. Best breakfast sausage in the city, I promise you that now. You interested there, bright eyes? <laughs> 